All right, we're back with Battletoads Arcade with the Quartermaster achievement. Ooh! Our first snapshot, passive aggression, requires you to beat 15 rats. Um, take as long as you want. The only important thing is as long as you don't die, you won't lose your counter. This looks awesome! So this game's super easy to kill these rats, you just combo them. I like to pick them up and throw them at other rats. If you actually pick up that like giant thing on the left side of the map, it actually makes it easier to kill these guys because they're a little tougher. It looks, it's so much more detailed. But for the most part, just punch them, beat them. Something that I didn't like figure out if first and you'll see is that to beat the pig who actually counts as a rat you have to knock him down and then run up and kick him in his big tushy tushy yeah give him a give him a nice one how do you do see i missed it so you give him that one and you give him that two. Oh, he comes to you though and then you move over and these are three final rats and because there's no time limit it's super easy yeah and you see i'm gonna just take my time like i said it's easier to throw them into each other because you do damage to both of them all right uh, if you want to be like a cool dude, the nice. best way to kill the rat is to throw him on the ground and then brain him with a giant drill. Jesus! What? There was blood coming out! That was so graphic! Alright, the next Battle snapshot the is Rash's Last Stand. You need to survive 15 seconds in this level. It's actually like really easy. If you just mash the B button, I think, which does this spin move, you'll like destroy everything a couple times. Spin and then win. you can literally just sit there and get hit for like the next 10 seconds. Who's your favorite Battletoad? Uh, if you just stick at the back of the ship, it'll be good. I don't fucking know. I haven't played these games I think mine's enough. Rash. He's in Killer Instinct. That's great. I haven't played that game. Yeah. Uh, easy does it. All right, the third snap is rats in a barrel. Rats in a barrel. Good job. You can read. Mm -hmm. uh, this one also requires you to beat 15 rats, but in 45 seconds. This one's annoying because these rats do this move where they like jump and land on you. I found it the easiest to hug the right side of the map and you like beat them up before they come in to do their jumping attack. Then you're gonna go up against the reindeer guy. He only takes one hit to kill. You kind of just have to wait till he's done spinning and then hit him. When he is spinning though, he's invincible. Now this is the hard part. There's gonna be two normal rats right here, but after you beat one up, it's gonna summon two silver rats who have guns. And if you're not careful and let them fire their guns, Jeez. you'll die like immediately. So you just kind of have to be quick and get both the gun rats out of the way. And just brain they them. Fire you. And then after that, uh, pretty just much give them a lobotomy. Do whatever it takes to die or keep going. You can keep killing enemies as long as you want. I get killed right there. Success! Stamp awarded! Alright, the fourth snap. Wrath of Karnath. Whoa! It requires you to beat Karnath without dying. So, this is actually like super easy. Karnath, looks awesome! Karnath always attacks the last place you were. So as long as you're constantly moving, you can predict where he'll be, and then you can just get a running start in him. You can get hit one time, but if you get hit twice, you will die. As you'll see, I do get picked up once. It leaves you with one blip of life left. Whoa! Oh my god! Yeah, it kind of fucks you up a little that bit. That looks awesome! But then, uh, Karnath himself gets fucked up when bulldozes his face off. That's just... Whoa! Whoa! Yo! No, that was so cool! Oh, and then cool. you have to kick it. Don't forget to kick it. Yeah! I want to play this really bad. That game looks so good! Alright, and the final snap is twice as mice which requires you to beat two general vermins at the same time. Go back to Karnath. So let them get stacked up, and then just hit them in the face with this concrete block like four times. Jesus. And then once that breaks, as you'll see right here, if you get close to them on the ground, they'll pick you up and start beating you up. So I found the fun, I found the easiest way to beat them is to jump and hit them in the face with the jump attack, which is an amble or your fist. As amble you fist. You leave a lot of space between you. Every time you hit them, just kind of go back to make sure you create enough space between you so he doesn't do his rush move. And, you know, a couple more smacks in the head. The yeah. purple one always dies first, but then the orange one goes down. Pimple Pimple ate the Vilville fruit so we can summon anvils from his body. That was the worst joke I've made all night. Not a joke, it's just lore. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. I don't think you know Everything's in the One Piece universe. All right, and that's that. Uh, thank you for joining us again. As always, play us at the end of the video, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye